Hi, I'm Victoria Pinder, EXP Realty. Here I'm at Adams Homes. I'm gonna show you in this community at Copper Creek, they only have like 35 homes that they're building in the back. It's nice, a little roundabout or circle. And then we're gonna go inside. One of the smaller ones, 1707, just to show you. But before we go inside, I want my husband to turn around and show that they are definitely building, that. that's the street that goes nowhere. But you can see that they are building bigger homes as well. So we're gonna go see one of the smaller ones, but they definitely have bigger ones. So now let's go on inside. So you can see this is 1707 square feet, um, which is really nice if you're looking to like a retire or you're really looking for the ranch home. Now I want you to imagine all of this will be grass on both sides. It will be sodded. If my husband turns around and shows you what the finished houses look like over there, you can see they put lots of grass. So you can see this will be all grass as well. They're not gonna dip you on the grass two-car garage while we're in the garage i want to point out that the electrical panel is over there obviously this will all be cleaned out before the walk-in is up there and then the the water heater is in the garage which means if it does something happen to the water heater it's inside not affecting the house now let's go inside because what's nice about this house is you come in you do have a foyer area and then you also for people who really want a formal dining room Boom, you walk in, you have a formal dining room. Don't think the lights work in here yet. It's okay. But you can see formal dining room. They are taking the extra time to put this. Little things, you really get the sense that this is the molding. A dining room. My husband's gonna turn around real quick and show you that this house is also very open concept. So while you have a formal dining room, it is not a walled. It is over there. Now, before we move on, I will walk over there in a minute, but I want to take you from the dining room into two bedrooms over here. This is the first bedroom. If you do need a work at home office, this is perfect because of the double windows and you can see everything happening outside. If you just want a room to where, you know, you get to enjoy light, which I always do, there's that. And then I want to point out with this one, double door dot closet. Obviously new construction, so things still stick sometimes. But it's a huge closet. I cannot touch both sides, even if I lay down. Moving on. Again, formal dining room over here, but I'm gonna continue down this path. You have the first of the full baths, a linen closet, which will have shelves, and the second more quieter bedroom if you're looking for a bedroom that's quiet still have two lovely windows and a closet that I definitely cannot touch both sides on my own. So you can see all these are, the, wind, the bedrooms are created too. You can add a fan, but that's on you. The only fans that come in this house are the master and the living room. So let's go back in here. We can continue on to the main room. Here's your linen closet, I mean your pantry. Food, it will have shelves. Refrigerator, as it should be together. Open concept, so you can still be washing the dishes and having a conversation with your family watching TV. Or cooking and talking to your family over here in the dining room. So it has a lovely thing. And also this is a nice thick granite. I know it still has the blue tape around it, so I'm just gonna peek it up for you a little bit. So you can see this is one, this is actually a level one granite, but it's still very lovely. You have your TV, obviously above the, the, the fireplace. That's an electrical fireplace. They are leveling the land in the back. So when they do, whenever you want to do something, you can. Another thing I like about the 1707 is that you could easily screen this indoor patio in. And they're grading the, yeah, they're going to grade it. You have to grade it and make it flat before you can saw it in. Now, I do like that a lot in this. And I love the fact that you have the formal dining room, but it is still open concept. We're going to go to the primary in a minute. But before we get there, you were in, you come in, you pull your car in, garage, and then you walk in, and here is where your refrigerator I mean your refrigerator, your washer and dryer go here. So if you're you know, worried about COVID again, we can put our stuff right in there and then not contaminate the rest of our house. Also, you have a second closet here. So if you're looking for 
more storage, you have this right here. And I love this open concept area a lot. Now let's go to the primary bedroom. With this bedroom, you have the bed can easily go here. You have a closet over there. You have a bathroom that's lovely. It's a really big bedroom. And this closet is huge. It doesn't have shelves yet, but it is definitely a walk-in closet. And that's quite lovely. Going into the master bathroom, the primary bathroom, you have two sinks. You see that they take the extra time to put light fixtures and it will have mirrors. Over here, you have a toilet that you can close the door to and it is a long haul, so it's not just like you're in a box. And then I like the fact that you have, for this specific model, they went with the upgraded tile, which is a lovely thing. It will have a glass door. And then it also has a tub. So you can see they have lots of extra little features in this community. Um, if you get something like this, you're also getting some decent deals. And we are super happy to talk to you. We have quite a few homes with Adams Homes Construction under contract already. So we would love to talk to you about how to get you the best deal. And so please call us at 252. Don't forget to call me, Victoria, so I can hang out with you and walk you through this process at 252-327-3357.